Welcome to Pat's Picks. This is the $20 Challenge. Thank you so much for coming by. Today is day 101, and I am very happy and relieved to say today was a green day. Made it short and sweet today, one and done. I was actually done before I even got out of bed with the small account, so very happy with that. Up 17% today. I made 50% on that one trade, uh, and that was a zero day till expire, 421 call in and out in about a minute very happy with that and as you can see up 100 on the futures account not going to dive into details on there too much but that's where i spent most of my time and whew, it was a, a long day but i'm grateful for green so without further ado let's dive right in thank you all so much for coming by i greatly appreciate it if you're new here please like and subscribe if you enjoy it and here we go looking at the five minute chart today was wild nice move um, actually, if you look above my head right here on the four hour, you can see a little bit better. We had a perfect almost V shape recovery right here. Flying V. Shout out to the Mighty Ducks, you know? That's a. Uh... <laughs> okay. So, anyways, we are at resistance right here at that 421 area. And we actually have a gap to fill um, between 420.55, I believe, and 422. And I will not be surprised if this gap fills. Um, pre-market on Tuesday so I'll be watching for that I know there's a lot of resistance right here um, but this gap is all the way from back in August and you can see if I scroll over on the four hour it's a little easier to see way back here and here is that well oh, not that gap this gap there we go so this is the gap I'm referring to uh, we already filled that one a couple times well before but this gap has not been touched since August, so it's going to be pretty interesting to see. Um, I expect some good volatility, some good candles up and down in that range. But I also won't be surprised if that happens after hours. So it's going to be a little frustrating, but it's all part of it. Um, whether it happens after hours or not, I do expect some volatility in the market in that general range. So anyways, without further ado, let's dive right into the one trade. One trade hill. Man, I'm just full of bad jokes right now. Holy cow. If you can't tell, I am a dad. Uh, and I'm full of dad jokes. So, uh, Trade one and done. In at 940. Out at 941. And I got in right here in the yellow. I was, I was looking for that break from that morning spike right here. So it went up. Had rejection right there. Came back down and bounced off those pre-market levels. So I felt pretty confident to get in. And I kind of waited for that confirmation and break back over 416. And I got in and out so fast. And I literally hadn't even gotten out of bed yet. I know nothing really to brag about. But uh, I wasn't up for the market. I usually don't like to trade for the first you know, 15 to 30 minutes. I try to kind of let the market play out and watch for trend. Um, but sometimes there's some good strong moves in that first 15 minutes or so. So uh, not to say I never trade that time frame. Um, but I usually don't. So today, I decided to go for it in about 10 minutes. So cannot complain. It felt good to be done, uh, especially after yesterday. And I thought about making another trade on there. But, you know, I decided it's Friday, be one and done, and walk away with the green Friday after just a pretty rocky week. So here's a look at the account. You can see up 17% today. If you're new here, I'm completely transparent. I share all my transaction banking history on here. And I think that's really the best way to learn. Uh, even on the red days, those days that I... Some days I really do not want to film. Um, but that's alright. They just make me better. It motivates me to trade better, be more disciplined. And uh, ultimately, I think that helps you guys even better. So full circle here. You guys help me help you. And uh, that's about all I have to say for the day before any more bad jokes come out. So uh, thank you all so much for watching. I greatly appreciate every single one of you guys. You know, when I look at all the numbers and subscribers, I truly do think about all the people behind that. You know, it's just not numbers. It's it's people that I, I really want to help. And so every day I try to do my best. And uh, so, yeah. So if you have any questions, please leave them down below. Be happy to help. Or if you just want to say hi or, or anything, whatever it is, uh, I hope you stay happy and healthy. I'll see you in a couple days.